back at the Hunger Games interview with this speech. Gail, please introduce yourself to us. Well, I'm Gail Hawthorne, and you know, I'm quite a good friend to Candace. I mean, cousin to Candace. We have, we have a strong relationship. So, what do you do in your free time? Um, I mostly hunt and provide food for my family. Normally with Katniss, my cousin. And we go out and we hunt and I normally make traps. Lots of traps. Traps? What? Snares? Snares, yes, definitely. Like, especially in the Hunger Games, lots of, lots of the easy parts of the uh, snares and things Katniss move. Uh, yeah, I've got to ask you, it's not um, illegal to go hunting outside the district. Um, yes, it is. You stay between the maybe. The rest of the world. The rest of the world, yes. Now, um, what do you do with your produce of your hunting morning? Um, you normally go to the hop and go and sell things, trade, trade. get more, more things from them, get more food, you know, get the feed of them. You know, because I have, like, I have a lot of brothers and sisters. Yeah, okay. Um, so now that Katniss is away, did you ever wonder whether she was going to make it? Or did you have full belief in her? I had full belief in her because I learned her skills and I knew that she would shoot squirrels straight into the eye and that she would take them off the other. Now, what could you have done if Katniss had not made it to the Hunger Games? Concerning her family? Well, and I would have warned her death. I would have stayed, tried to stay strong, maybe better out of two. Yeah. If, if you were a woman or a girl, would you have volunteered for Katniss? Yes, I would. But I also had full, 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 How do you feel about her relationship between, the relationship between Pizza and Katniss? So you never felt like confronting Thank you.